Hi, welcome to Vedic Mathematics. In this video, we are going to see two important principles of Vedic Mathematics, Nikilam Navata Charamam Dasata and Ekan Yunena Purvena. Let us see how they are, what they are and how it is used. Basically, we use a decimal system. And this decimal system, suppose I want to, uh, when you are using uh, bigger numbers, more than five or bigger than five, it will be difficult to handle, right? Somewhat either addition or subtraction, it will be a bit, we feel a bit difficult. But coming to the below five, we easily do either addition or subtraction. So, Using these two principles, this method is uh, made simple in addition and subtractions. Let us see how they are used. Suppose I take a number, a single digit number, which is in decimal place, number, decimal system. So eight, uh, I want to convert it into uh, another system like uh, 10 minus eight becomes two, right? So I make this, write this as a bar two or minus two, okay? So bar two, I have indicated this 10 minus eight as a two. Actually this is the eight, our number is eight. I put this in a less than five form. That is bar two. The meaning of it is, and one more thing is, when you are converting this number bar two, besides this number, whatever you have, add one to that. And here we have zero. I have added zero to one to zero. So that is one. 1 plus 0, 1. So the actual meaning of this is 10 minus 2 is 8. This 10, 10 in the uh, tens place, 10 minus 2 is our number in decimal system. So here, this sort of writing the numbers in smaller form is called vinculum number, right? Vinculum notation. So here, we are going to use this vinculum means negative face value. The value here we have taken, never we have seen a, a minus eight or minus six, something like that. So here we have seen a bar two. This bar two is a negative value. So this, uh, that's why it is called, uh, because of this negative face value, we call this uh, system as vinculum. So, the numbers which are uh, equal to or greater than 5 are converted to this vinculum notation. Now, suppose I take another number, 38, and I want to write this in a vinculum notation. So, take 10 here, and uh, 10 minus 8 becomes bar 2 minus 2, that is, I write it as bar 2. And next, the to the left side, whatever the number is there, 1 is added to that. So three becomes four. The meaning of this is 40 minus two is this number. Are you getting it? Next. Suppose I have taken another number, 79, and I want to convert this into vinculum notation. So I take uh, 10 here, right? Next, I take nine here. Here comes the principle called uh, Nikhilam Navata Charamam Dasata. The meaning of it is, suppose if you have some more numbers on the left side, all these numbers are subtracted from 9. As you have taken 9 here, all these numbers should be subtracted from 9, except the last one, right? The meaning of this is all numbers from 9 and the last one from 10. The last one is this. When you have more numbers, we will understand that. So for the time being, this is a formula of converting this to vinculum notation used is the sutram or formula nikhilam navata charamam dasataha. So convert this 10 minus 9 minus 1 that is bar 1, 9 minus 7 bar 2 and uh, nothing is here so 0, 0 plus 1, 1. The meaning of this is 100 minus this my minus signs, 100 minus 21. So 100 minus 21. So like this, next I take another number, 168. 
again uh, i want to convert this into winkelmann notation I take a 9 10 here 9 here and because it is a small number nothing is uh, taken right not necessary only this is for bigger numbers equal to or more than 5 now convert this 10 minus 8 bar 2 minus 2 9 minus 6 minus 3 and here we have 1 so 1 should be added to this 1 plus 1 2 so this becomes 2 the meaning is 200 minus 32 is this number you can got it 200 minus 32 is this number okay now you may ask one thing suppose we have this winkelmann notation what is the use of it we have we use only this numbers which are in decimal system so we should convert this we should know that how to convert this winkelmann notation to decimal system here again we use the same principle nikhilam navatah das charamam dasatah that is i take uh, uh, 10 here right last number 10 and only for these uh, minus numbers right for these minus numbers only i take 10 in the last only that two and here is a small number and no negative that's it now 10 minus 2 is 8 here comes one more from decimal system to winkelmann we have added one now we subtract that is in the left side number whatever you have to this this number should be subtracted by one that is 1 minus 1 0 so no number here 0 so here comes the second formula eka nyunena purvena the meaning of it is the earlier number the number is this this earlier number is a sub one less this is subtracted by one to get this okay one less than the previous one the one one less than right this is the previous number one less than this is zero so zero here so winkelmann's notation to decimal system when you are converting the numbers we use this second union a purvena number next so simply you will be using the same method 10 here and only for these negative numbers 10 minus 2 8 and less 1 4 minus 1 3 so this is a decimal number system next i take uh, 10 here 9 here this is the principle nikhilam principle is this nikhilam navata charamam dasatah so i take 9 here and nothing is this is a positive number so nothing is necessary not necessary so 10 minus 1 9 9 minus 2 7 1 minus 1 0 okay eka nyunena one less so 1 minus 1 0 here next 10 9 here nothing here 10 minus 2 8 okay 9 minus 3 6 2 minus 1 1 so this number when is it is converted to decimal system we get 168 so like this we convert the numbers into winkelmann notation so here we take let us say take some more examples and let us see how to convert a bigger number five digit number here all these are all greater than 5 so we start with the 10 here last one all these numbers should be having 9 right all these numbers should be subtracted from 9 so 9 9 9 9 okay now let us write this in the oh, winkelmann notation 10 minus 1 9 minus 1 9 minus 6 minus 3 9 minus 8 minus 1 9 minus 7 minus 2 9 minus 8 minus 1 and 1 should be added in the left side Zero. We don't have any. So zero plus one, one. So this is the winkelmann notation. The meaning of it is one. Besides one, one, two, three, four, five zeros. So one lakh. One lakh minus this number, twelve thousand one thirty one, gives you this number. One lakh minus this twelve thousand one thirty one gives you this number. We are not changing the. number number is not changed but only the form is changed clear 
Next, suppose if you want to get the decimal system from this, here you understand clearly, this number should be subtracted from 10, right? 10 minus 10. And all the others, all these negative numbers from 9. So 9, 9, 9, 9. 10 minus 1, 9. 9 minus 3, 6. 9 minus 1, 8. 9 minus 2, 7. 9 minus 1, 8. 1 should be subtracted from this. So 1 minus 1, 0. So this is the conversion of from Vinculum to why we, all this is, we need these basic principles before we uh, implement them. That's why we are learning this. Next, we take another number. So here we have only four, these four numbers are bigger. This is not. Let us see. In, in the bigger in the sense, either it should be equal to five or greater than five. Then only we can uh, apply this Winkelum notation. So we take uh, 10 here, nine, Nine, nine. Now convert it to Winkelum notation. Ten minus six minus four. Nine minus eight minus one. Nine minus seven minus two. Nine minus seven minus two. Three should be one should be added to three, so it becomes four. So forty thousand minus two thousand two fourteen gives you this number. How did you get this? This is the number. So in the tens place, tens thousands place, we have four. So 40,000 minus 2214 gives you this number. Clear? Now, suppose if you want to convert from Winkelum to decimal system. Suppose you are given this number and I want to convert it to decimal system. How? Take last 10, 9, 9, 9. This is positive, so not, not necessary. 10 minus 4, 6. 9 minus 1, 8. 9 minus 2, 7. 9 minus 2, 7. And 1 less, 1 less from here. 4 minus 1, 3. So that's how we got it. You take any size of the number, whatever the number of digits in it, you take it, apply the same principle here, last one 10. Right? Charamam. Charamam in the sense in the end. In the end, 10 and all the remaining 9. So 9, 9. Okay. One more thing. Here we have 4, a small number, less than 5. Not necessary here. What do we do? We treat this point, these three numbers as one set. And from here, we treat this as another set. So I'm taking, I just left this 4 as it is. Started again, uh, that means I am treating this as the rightmost number. So in this set, this is the rightmost number. So 10 here, 9 here, okay? And this is uh, less than 5, not necessary. That's it. Now convert. 10 minus 7, minus 3, 9 minus 8, minus 1, 4, 1 should be added. So 4 plus 1, 5. That one set is over. Next, start another set. 10 minus 6, minus 4. 9 minus 9, 0. Either 0 or uh, 0 minus 0, doesn't matter. And 1 here. This 1 should be added to 1. That is, it becomes 2. So, we have two sets. 200 minus 4 gives this. And 500 minus this 500 minus 13 gives this one clear. So we are going to use this uh, method and uh, one more thing, revert, reversion. We come to the decimal system. Last one, 10. This is 9. Not necessary because this is positive number. Okay. And this is one set. So not necessary here. Here again, we start with 10 here, 9 here. Okay. Now that's it. This is positive. So convert 10 minus 3, 7, 9 minus 1, 8, 4, 1 less, right? 5 minus 1, 4. So 4 is here. 10 minus 4, 6, 9 minus 0, 9, 2 minus 1, 1. That's how you get uh, these uh, decimal numbers back.
Now, we will implement this and uh, see how addition is simplified. We are going to simplify the addition of our numbers using this Winkelum notation. Now, I have taken a very simple number, a small number, 49 is added with 87, right? Here, only these three numbers are bigger. And let us see how to do this. Take the 49, I take 49. I start with the rightmost number 10. This is four smaller number, not necessary. So convert this 49 into Winkelum system. That is 10 minus 9 minus 1. And 4 should be, 1 should be added to this 4. So becomes 5. The meaning is 50 minus 1 is this number. Are you getting it? 50 minus 1 is nothing but 49. So 50 plus minus 1. Similarly, convert this also into Winkelum. 10 here, right? And 9 here, because it is bigger. 9 here. And no number is there. So next, 10 minus 7, minus 3. 9 minus 8, minus 1. And add 1 to this 0. So 1, right? So let us add these numbers. Instead of adding these, because we have very simple numbers here. 1, 3, 5, 1, 1. Oh, very simple. Let us see. Minus 1, minus 3, minus 4. Plus 5, minus 1, plus 4. Plus 1. This is the number. This is the answer in Winkelum notation. But we have to convert this into decimal system. How? Let us take the uh, on top of this. We take 10 here, right? 10 base, 10, 10 minus 4, 6, and 1 less here. So 4 minus 1, 3, and 1 as it is. So 136 in decimal system is the answer. Write 136 here. That's it. You can just add these two numbers. You get. So uh, to simplify the addition, when you are doing large problems, bigger problems, just convert them into this notation and uh, do it very fast. Next. I take in a, a bigger number, right? Four, five digits added with the... Uh, another five digits, right? So convert this first number into Winkelum, 10, 9, 9, 9, 9, okay? 10 minus 9, minus 1, 9 minus 6, minus 3, 9 minus 6, minus 3, 9 minus 7, minus 2, 9 minus 8, minus 1, and 0 here, 0 plus 1, right? Next. Convert this also, 10, 9, 9, 9, that's all. Here, this is smaller number, not necessary. So, 10 minus 6, minus 4, 10 mi 9 minus 8, minus 1, 9 minus 7, minus 2, 9 minus 7, minus 2, and 1 should be added here, 2, 3, that becomes 4, 3 plus 1, right? Now, you see, here, all the bigger numbers, just we take a step back when you want to add these numbers. But we'll be enthusiastic to add these smaller numbers, isn't it? So let us add these in the Winkelum system. Minus 1, minus 4, minus 5, minus 3, minus 1, minus 4, minus 5 here, minus 4 here, minus 1, plus 4, plus 3, plus 1. That's it. So this is in the Winkelum system. Convert it into decimal. How? Nikhilam navata charamam dasataha. End 10, all others 9. 10, 9, 9, 9. This is positive, not necessary. So convert 10 minus 5, 5. 9 minus 4, 5. 9 minus 5, 4. 9 minus 4, 5. And one less here. 3 minus 1, 2. 1 as it is. That's it. So this is the answer in decimal system. Write this number here. 1, 2, 5, 4, 5, 4. So this, if you add these two numbers, you get this. 
So you see how simple the addition is made, right? We'll take, uh, we'll see at another example. So here we have a bigger number and uh, out of all these, all are bigger values except for another number in uh, six digits. Here in the end also we have a smaller number. In the beginning also a smaller number. Let us see how to handle this. Now, we start with the 10, rightmost 10, 9 here, 9 here. Not necessary because we have 4, less value. Next, we start, we treat this as one unit. From here, again, another. That is 10 here and 9 here. You can leave it as it is even, right? Because it is equal to 5, you want, you can convert or not necessary. You can even convert to only greater than 5. It's up to you. Whether you want to convert this also, it's up to you. So I have taken, right? So 10 here. 10 minus 7, minus 3. 9 minus 8, minus 1. 9 minus 6, minus 3. And 4 plus 1, 5. Next, 10 minus 6, minus 4. And here, 5 plus 1, 6. Clear? Next. Apply the same principle to this one also. Where to start? Is it necessary to stay, take uh, 10 here? Not at all. Because this is a smaller number, less than 5. So we'll start with this. Here, I have left 5, but I am want to include 5. It's up to you. Okay? So let us see what happens. 10 here. 9, 9, 9. Nothing. Because smaller value. Convert. 4 comes as it is. 10 minus 5. Minus 5. Right? 9 minus 9. 0. 9 minus 7. Bar 2. 9 minus 8. Bar 1. 3 plus 1. 4. So add these numbers here. So let's add these. How? Oh, plus 4 minus 3. Plus 1. Minus 1, minus 5, minus 6. Minus 3, minus 0, minus 3. Plus 5, minus 2, plus 3. Plus or minus in the sense, this is, doesn't have any bar in the top. So this is positive. Minus 4, minus 1, minus 5. Plus 6, plus 4, plus 10. Okay? Now, convert this into decimal numbers. How? Not necessary. This is positive. So not necessary. This is a rightmost number and a negative. 10 here. My 9. Not necessary. This is positive. So again, this is a negative. So 10, start 10 here. Nothing is necessary here. So 1 comes as it is. 10 minus 6, 4. 9 minus 6, Six, nine, sorry, 9 minus 3, 6. And uh, 3 minus 1, 2. That is, wing column to decimal, you have to subtract 1. Plus 1. So, 3 minus 1. 10 minus 5, 5. Right? 1 less here. Right? 10, you take 10. 10 minus 1, 9. So, 9. So you write this number 952641 here. That will be the answer to this addition. Okay. So it appears to be uh, very uh, a bit uh, laborious when you I want to add these numbers. So one way of simplifying these numbers into Winkelheim system is this. Okay. Next. Let us take an, one more example. So I have taken four numbers. I don't want to add, right? So here, uh, you use the same method, right? You have taken a, a 10 here, started with the 10, 9, not necessary for these two smaller numbers, and uh, started with the 10 again, and nothing is here. Okay, convert this, 10 minus 7, minus 3, 9 minus 8, minus 1, and uh, 1 added here. 
3 plus 1, 4. 4 as it is, 10 minus 8, minus 2, 0 plus 1, plus 1. Next, not necessary here. You can start with the 10, 9, not necessary, smaller number. So, 10 here, convert. 4 as it is, 10 minus 5, 9 minus 9, 0, 4 plus 1, 5, 10 minus 7, minus 3, and 0 here, right? 0 plus 1, 1. Next, here we have 8, right? So, 10, we have taken 10, and a smaller number, not necessary. So, a bigger number again, start with the 10. If you have a bigger number here also, you would have taken 9, but it's a smaller number. Just leave it. Bigger number, 10. So, how to convert? 10 minus 8, minus 2. 3 plus 1, 4. 10 minus 9, minus 1. Bar 1. Right? 1 plus 1, 2. 10 minus 9, bar 1. 0 plus 1, 1. Clear? So here, we have converted. Next, this also. These two numbers are smaller. So start with the 10 here. Right? 10, 9, 9. So 3 and 4 comes as it is. 10 minus 9, bar 1. 9 minus 7, bar 2. 9 minus 6, bar 3. 0 plus 1, 1. Now let us add these. You observe either 5 or less than 5 you have here. All the numbers. So adding them is easy. Let us add. Minus 3 plus 4 minus 2 plus 4. How much? Okay. So plus 3. Minus 1 minus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 1. So 4 plus 4 minus 1 minus 1 plus 2 plus 4, plus 5, plus 2, minus 2. These two will go, and then 4 plus 1, 9. 4 plus 5, 9. Minus 2, minus 3, minus 1, minus 3. Minus 9. 1 plus 1, plus 1, 4. Right? So, convert only this negative value. All others are positive. So, just convert this one into 10. Take 10 here. Convert this into decimal system. Right? 3, 1, 2, 9 comes as it is. No change. 10 minus 9, 1. 5 or 4 minus 1. Subtract 1. So 4 minus 1. So this is the answer. 3, 1, 9, 2, 1, 3. 3, 9, 9, 2, 1, 3. This is the answer. So like this, when you have, when you want to do bigger well calculations, bigger additions, this will be, this method will be of lot of helpful and you can do it very easily. Once you just practice it, it won't take much time, right? Okay. So, with another Vedic principle, we'll meet in the next video. Thank you very much. All the best.